Support Laneside. Get something cool. Hey everybody and welcome to another edition of Laneside Reviews. As always, I'm the bearded beast, Rob Johnson, joined once again by Scoops Porter. And we've got some really exciting stuff to show you on this episode, so why don't we take it Laneside and see how it's stacked up. All right, guys, welcome back. As always, we're joined by our speed dominant player, Wayne Porter. He's bowling on the easy house shot. Now the crypto. This is the new benchmark ball. Oh, I look kind of nice. Benchmark ball. Uh, new benchmark ball from Radical. This is replacing probably one of our favorite, my favorite, the bonus. Yeah. Um, which replaced the Intel. Yeah. This is an interesting little ball. We saw it's got a little bit of performance there. So let's talk a little bit about this new version here. The little bit might be an understatement. Oh, yeah? <laughs> um, it's got the new AI 45 cover stock. Okay. So that means it's got the highest load of additives that they've ever put any ball. Now, if my memory serves me correctly, before that, wasn't it the ludicrous? Didn't that have like the AI 43 or the something? The 43, yeah. So, so, I mean, that was a really strong yeah, ball. Yeah, I was going to say, that wasn't quite a benchmark ball either. But <laughs> it's got the new crypto core in it. Yep. So And uh, surfaced at 502,000. This it, thing is set to uh, be smooth. Yeah. S quote, unquote, so smooth. smooth. Yeah. Um, well, it's, it's smooth. <laughs> so we saw Wayne strike at, uh, at his benchmark spot. Yeah. Or, you know, we've moved him a little bit. We saw... I don't know if he threw that one really yeah, good. So why don't we give him another that, shot yeah. at it here? We moved two and one left. So this thing has a lot of cover on it. This thing feels furry. Yeah. Oh, he dropped it. Look at it come back. Ooh, oh, no hand in it. It, it still, still looks. Does. Yeah. <laughs> now that has, it looked like it had a little bit more motion down lane than I was expecting it of a benchmark. Well, exactly. That's that's what I was implying because, man, it, it picks up strong in the mids. Yeah. And, but it doesn't give up anything in the back end. Like... Yeah, it uses. It doesn't seem to burn up very quickly in the no, front. Yeah. It sees the mid, and then it doesn't just quit on you. With something that that much additive and surface prep like that, I'd expect it to almost roll out if you get it too wide and kind of getting it to the dry. Yeah, and, right. But it doesn't burn up in the front. Like it's it's smooth for sure. But now we moved them right this this time to see if we could get him to throw it harder <laughs> but um it sees the friction a lot more than i expected yeah um even for our our speed dominant quo or slash rev or deficient do bowler yeah. <laughs> um, it really saw that friction yeah he just it's got hook <laughs> yeah um for him like i know he struck from his benchmark spot moving him right's really not an option why don't we try something like I mean, we could try to move them left. Yeah. Move them left a little bit. Kind of a little bit off his, off his benchmark, right? We saw how much, even when yeah. he he kind of didn't didn't throw it very well, how yeah. hard it came back. That that seven pin. Yeah. Or sorry, that ten pin. Ten pin. Yeah. I mean, it, it still went down. It like it had a good motion to it. I mean, that was amazing. But yeah, he just kind of dropped it. That's a little better. That was 24. Wow. That was four boards left. Yeah. So, uh, I mean, effectively, I think what what I'm seeing here is he struck on 20 and 24. He's got about a, a two to four board um, yeah. versatility with this. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> got to wait for the ball no, to no, come back. Right. Yeah. And here he is throwing it uh, approximately left-handed. Approximately. <laughs> Do we call him Young Guy Wayne when he's opposite? <laughs> I'm sure he'd appreciate it. <laughs> and look at it. Look at it. Read and set up. Yeah. He, he doesn't look impressed though. He's confused. He's look. <laughs> how did that make it back? Yeah. Now here we are with our bonus. This is is our benchmark ball. Yeah. And uh, I even though you can see strike same place i think yeah. we're gonna see just a little bit different a little bit different a little bit different in the way that the motion is on this now we've used the same layout on the ball yeah. so we're we're really showing apples to apples here we're seeing about two boards out yeah. and a little stronger move to the pocket yeah but almost identical yeah now for somebody like Wayne, would you bring the surface up maybe more even? 
and see if that would help? At or would, do you think that would create more angularity? I think it might cause more angularity. Now, here you are with it. Um, at 502,000, that's a pretty good surface for him, that skip yeah. sand. It's still pretty early. Yeah. We, I mean, we don't usually put him in, we wouldn't put him into a benchmark symmetric. Yeah. Um, but this crypto seemed to have enough motion. I would honestly consider it. For you being, I mean, oh, good good heavens, you you struck, oh no. Oh, my benchmark <laughs> shot. <laughs> Woo! Um for you, how did you feel when you threw this? Because this is saying this is five hundred two thousand. This is a lot of, uh, a lot of surface. I would have never guessed this was in the benchmark category. I would have th thought this was a mid performance Ooh. because it's got pop. It does have right? some potential like pop. I, yeah. I kind of came around that one and forced it out a little bit further. Yep. And it still kind of jumped back and just kind of cut across. Like that was a four nine, ish. <laughs> It was scary. Now, I did notice while we were doing the testing on this, our bonus, my only, and people are going to be amazed at this, my only detraction from the bonus, and I'm actually saying something wrong with it, it lane shines really quick. Yeah. This ball did not lane no, shine. No, no. It's, I mean, maybe it's all the additive that's in there, but you see that one, it kept closer. Oh! And just, it kind of tickled because so, it has Dynamicore. Woo! I forgot to mention that. I, I bet. <laughs> I bet Randy Peterson Peterson could have carried that eight pin if he'd had oh, dynamic core. Probably, yeah. Oh, uh, that was a bit of a fast eight. Maybe we'll get you yeah. to throw that spot again. Yeah. Um, but yeah, even though it has a ton of surface, uh, it looks like it should hook. Yeah. Uh, it looks just like the ludicrous and other big balls yeah. we see like that that are furry. Well, you, you expect yeah. it to to read at your feet, but it actually does get down yeah. lane. You can see. Look at that one. Got that way outside and just raced back. But that's the thing is you can you can watch it start to pick up very strong in the mid. It's like like it's advertised. Yep. It's just I that the pop off the end is just what's really surprising. Like it retains so much energy that it just I'm very moves. surprised at the amount of motion on this. Uh, I expected it to be much smoother, just like yourself. Yeah. This thing might outhook the uh, Hammer Obsession Tour Solid, oh. which is an asymmetric. Yeah. Look at this. You moved another three boards left after that 10-pin, and wow. it hit harder. Yeah. Good heavens. Yeah. It just, I mean, it's it's an amazing ball, for sure. Like, the motion on it is really nice. It actually, I, I kind of like it because it's so smooth, but it gives that extra little bit. It just has a little yeah. bit more finish. Yeah. yeah. It'd definitely be nice, nice on the fresh, you know. This one, I came around a little bit. Boom. Still, even though you came around, created yeah. a little bit more length, it yeah. didn't deflect. No. Yeah. That's that cover getting it to roll. Yeah. Now, here you are with the bonus. Yeah. Oh, wh what did they lose there? I see the, you lose on the oh, count there. Oh, I think everybody just lost the game. Oh, no. Oh, sorry about that. Now, you can see that that's our bonus. That is a yeah. very smooth motion. Yeah. It's just... Nice and tight down. We're using the exact same layout, ball to ball. We wanted yeah. to do apples to apples. Yeah. Here you are. Uh, I think we're seeing about the same thing we saw with Wayne. Yeah. Just about on top of each other. Yeah. I'm seeing uh, a versatility of from between about zero up to about eight boards for yeah. you as a matched player. Uh, we're going to put them right on top of each other so you can actually s see... There you go. See them cross. That's so cool. You created two yeah. very and different shapes, shapes there yeah. as well. That's what really I think impresses me the most about this yeah. ball. Uh, here I am coming up with it here in just a second. I think that's really what impressed me is the pure versatility. Yeah. With the bonus, with the Intel, um, when it's time for that ball, oh, oh looks so good. I know. <laughs> uh, when it's time to throw that ball, it's money. Yeah. But you know when it's time to get out of it because it doesn't have, like I could twirl it, I could spin it, and yeah. it would still be very smooth. Yeah. Um, which was great forgiveness if I threw a bad shot. But when the lane started to change, if I needed to open them up a little bit, I got to make a ball lane change, change yeah. rather than make a release change or a line change. Yeah. Um, you can see there I, I struck it. Somehow I struck it my benchmark, benchmark spot. I'm gonna move another three and two left here. 
uh, and you might see a pattern. Oh, I think that strike. I think that went <laughs> off yeah. over or behind the eight pin. Yeah. This thing just <coughs> it sees it, and it makes its move, and it never stops. Yeah, it's very continuous through the pin deck. It's, it's. I mean, that's what a symmetric's supposed to do. It's supposed yep. to. And create that's a big sweeping arc motion and keep going. And right? it's what you want out of your yeah. benchmark, that's yeah. for sure. So, Now, for you Rev Dominant players, you may want to take a little surface off. You can see I'm pretty deep with this. Yeah. A lot of the time when I throw my benchmark, I like to be a little closer to center. Um, yeah. Obviously, during the summer here, we're seeing a little more friction. A little more friction. So I'm forced a little bit left. I'm going to move another three left. Wow. That one's set up nice. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm already six boards left. I think you should keep going. Uh, I'm. What do I always do? I keep going until I either run out of lane or run out of energy. <laughs> probably, I probably run out of energy before, before I run out of lane. <laughs> but this one, I'm not sure. <laughs> it's just, it was surprising to say, like definitely the reaction. Like I said, it wasn't what I was expecting when we thought we're getting like a benchmark ball like i thought it was going to be closer to like you said the bonus and the intel where it's just so i'm going to move five here oops uh, whoopsie okay well you, you missed <laughs> hey, look at it look at my hand there yeah. i think I, I think you got to let go of the ball <laughs> i think um, you should probably try again yeah I'll, I'll try that one again um yeah no this this is different than the benchmarks i've seen from radical I think this is actually different from just about every benchmark that I've seen from the different brands of Brunswick. Um, this might actually outhook my webs and web web tour, those kind of balls. Yeah. It's weird to say it outhooks it and yet is still smooth because those aren't those aren't things that go together. No, that's and that's kind of what's surprising about it's, this ball. It's it's still hooking a lot down lane. I'm yeah. I'm going to be at 35 here, so I'm yeah. now 11 boards left of where I started. Brooklyn. Brooklyn. Wow, that <laughs> one caught something. Well, I was <laughs> trying to spin it. Oh, to yeah. to get it to, to read. I don't, I don't think I have to spin it. No, no. Uh, jeez. <laughs> wow. Um, but yeah, like, I can see myself, because of the the huge versatility w that I can see out of this, yeah. the shapes I can create, I can see this replacing my bonus in my bag. Wow. Um. Well, you'd definitely be able to stay in it a little bit longer. Well, than and that's bonus, it. Right? Because, like I mean, here I am with my bonus. And you can see it's smooth. It sees it, but yeah. it's much, much smoother. Yeah. Maybe Phil got sick and tired of listening us talk about how good the bonus is, so they had to come up with something to make you take it out of your bag. Maybe. I don't know. But look at this. Would we say based on bon on benchmark? That's right there. So it does everything my bonus does. But wait! There's more! <laughs> well, that's the thing, right? That's what makes this ball special. Yeah. This really, it, it blew my mind. I'm going to move deeper. I'm not even showing the deeper shot I hit with it, but you can see I can create very different amounts yeah. of motion on the lane. Um, I mean, we didn't even make fun of the title of it, Crypto. No. There's nothing to say about it. It's just buy it now. Get it before it goes up. Oh, there we go. <laughs> buy it before it goes up. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a show. So until next time, guys, we'll see you lane side.